Hi, this is Shashmit from Paraguay Technologies. Today I am going to demonstrate how we can use account schedules to display the charts such as finance performance charts available in Navision 2016. For this video, I presume that the viewer have the basic functional and technical understanding on Navision 2013 R2, 2015 or 2016 versions. There are some exciting features in Navision which remains untouched because they are never used by the client and due to the busy schedules, not everyone get a chance to explore these things. So let's start by creating a basic monthly sales chart. This would also require a basic understanding of finance and accounts. Also this video is for demonstration purpose only. The account schedules and column layout options used here are selected at random. For proper setting of account schedules, you should have a proper understanding of finance and accounting. As we have the functionality in Navision to change the role center page for every user, we can do it from user personalization card. We can change the profile ID from here. For example, I'll use the president's small business. So let's create a finance performance chart for the president of the company. As the president of the company would like to see the finance performance or sales performance or inventory performance and how well they are doing. So let's create the charts for example sales performance, for example finance performance. For that we need to create account schedules. So first of all we create an account schedule, click on select chart. Click new to create a new account schedule in the chart list. On this card enter the required field, enter name as monthly sales. Enter the description here. From account schedule name create a new account schedule. From here we can create a new account schedule. Enter the name as sales underscore m and description as monthly sales. Click on edit account schedule. This is the window where we can insert the GL accounts uh, which are linked to the sales. For example, I am using here the monthly sales. So I have to insert the GL accounts which are linked to the sales. So I look, I'll look up for the sales and I'll select the domestic EU and raw material sales. So this is the value that is inserted. Click OK. OK. And the account schedule name is created. Now next is we have to create the column layout name. From the new option in the column layout we can create a new column layout. So we can name the column layout as sales underscore m and the description is monthly sales and when we click on edit column layout setup we can enter the column header here. So for example I am taking the net change debit and credit and balance at date for debit and credit. We can change the column type options from here like we have net change, we have balance at date, beginning balance year to date, rest of fiscal year and entire fiscal year. So I am selecting the balance at date for both of this. As the nature of the debit is always positive so I need to show it when it is always positive and I need to show the credit when it is negative. For showing the credit amount above the x axis, I am selecting the show opposite sign from here so that it will be shown above the x axis. Now our column layout is created. Next is to set up the y axis for charts. From here I can select the type of graph for example I will select line or I can select column. I 
I'll select the base x axis as period so that x axis will be divided into different periods. For example, I want this in the period length of 3 months. Click OK. Now our chart is created. We can drill down th through these charts. The same can be done over a web client as well. If you click on any charts at any point then the chart will show from where the value is linked. This is the finance performance card. Uh, I can change the period length from here. For example, I can change it to quarter. I can change this to year. When I run the finance performance chart. For example, if I click on the net change, the chart will show the credit amount as we have selected the show opposite for credit amount. This chart is showing the chart about the x axis. Now the net change is negative but it is showing above the x axis because we have selected show opposite sign from the account schedule card. There are many options that can be designed in this finance performance charts using account schedules or you can design sales performance charts or inventory performance. The same can be done using finance performance functionality in Navision. Thanks for watching the video. You can visit us at www.paraguide.com.